Uh, we also have Nahid uh, from Samajwadi Party. But just a quick recap for our viewers. Uh, the Women's Reservation Bill, which grants 33% reservation for women in Lok Sabha and State Assemblies, has been passed by the Lok Sabha with a whopping 454 votes in favor and two against. And these two are the MIM MPs. Remember the last time it was in 2010 when the UPA managed to, ma managed to get it passed in the Rajya Sabha at that time. It was uh, with 186 for one, but it failed to table it in the Lok Sabha because there were protests by the Samajwadi Party, the JDU and the RJD. Today, Samajwadi Party is on board. They are on board. They realize the time has come for women to be present and their political representation to increase, Nahid. No, all women wanted that there should be reservation for women and certainly everybody is happy about it. But when, it, when we talk about gender equality, then we must also talk about social justice for women. Now, in this bill, 54% of population, that is the OBC women, they have been totally ignored. Injustice has been done to them. Now, when amendment could be done in the bill and they could bring about amendment for SCST women, then why couldn't they do the same amendment for OBC women? Now, it's clear that BJP is an anti-OBC party. The very foundation of BJP was laid on 6th April 1980 uh, on the basis that OBC, SC, ST cannot become the Prime Minister of the country, be it in the case of Honorable uh, Chaudhary Charan Singh Ji or Honorable Babu Jagji Van Ram Ji. So BJP okay. is an anti party. Okay, just, BJP is an anti Just let me comp complete. Okay, so you have report. this charge. Uh, charge? Yes. Shazia, no, no, you are I facing the charge of being anti-woman on the day that you, you know that the BJP ensured the passage of this legislation. At least let me complete Maria, it's my... So, it's so sad, it's so sad that I have to hear from the likes of Nahid, whose party actually made sure that women do not get the due. It was after all Samajwadi party MPs which tore up the bill the first time around and it made sure that for 30 years women are deprived of the place that they deserve to be there. So shame on you, Nahid. Thank you for not tearing up the bill this time. Thank you for not tearing up the bill this time. But listen, people can see through okay. the shenanigans.